Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I just want you to know that I'm a resin artist and I own a store as well. And in today's video, that is what I am going to show you. I will be fulfilling a customer's order. The customer wanted a keychain with of the letter B with pink butterfly charms and hence you can see the mold. Uh, so they want everything to be floral and pink. So here are the flowers that I have selected and picked out for this keychain and for the uh, butterfly let's see what we think of doing ahead my first step would be to you know clean the mold properly sorry to clean the mold properly and to check for any kind of dirt which i will be doing as you can see i have cleaned the mold and sprayed it with isopropyl alcohol now my next step is going to be um, arranging these florals into the letter the basic arrangement is ready now just to you know cut the monotony of too much pink i will be using green leaves and I will just add them at some places you can just randomly throw it uh, if you're not able to you know reach each and every nook and corner because after you pour the raisin you can arrange them again now for the butterfly charms with the keychain i'm going to be adding golden and pink glitter because it'll be too floral otherwise and yeah so i'll just add it in the butterfly instead of adding it into the raisin Now you can just use either a toothpick or any pointed thing that is around. I'm using this and just mix the shades. I have mixed my raisin. Now I'm going to start pouring very carefully. guys so this is about 16 17 hours later um and most of it is dry like all of it is dry so now i'll be removing them from the mold let's start with the butterfly charms see they look beautiful i still have to remove the excess and everything Coming to the keychain, are you ready? Let's hope there is no bubble and beautiful. I think I love it. It's beautiful. so in the last clip as you saw i demolded this um letter now i'm going to drill a hole in it using my uh, drill electric drill so i have drilled a hole now i'll just put an eye screw and a keychain okay so remember one thing when you make thicker um, key rings 
like if you can see this is very thick right then you have to drill a hole like this and you and use a eye screw otherwise for thinner letters you can just do a hole this way and just put it jumping directly so uh, since this is a thicker key ring i'll be using the eye screw uh, this is how the eye screw looks i'm just going to take my letter and put it in the hole and you just using a plier or your hands based on your convenience you just hold the eye screw and rotate and it's secure now using a jump ring and a key ring i'm going to connect the jump ring and the key ring to this and you see me doing that now so as you can see there's a hole in this and now for the second butterfly there's a hole in this as well so now as you can see we have the connector ready and we have two butterflies and now we have to connect these two butterflies to this so i don't want to directly connect it i want to you know give it a separate chain here so i am using this chain that i have cut out from a usual pendant chain so i'm going to be using this and i need two jump rings as well to go through my uh, uh, you know butterflies so i'll be using those as well and i'll just show you those in a second so um, here is the jump ring and i got this size because this is the jump ring that would easily pass through the butterfly so here is my butterfly and my jump ring i'm going to pass my jump ring through the hole of the butterfly to try and make sure it comes and it came out and i'm just going to you know fold it using a plier sorry i couldn't show you so my two butterflies with the jump ring are ready first using a jump ring i'm going to connect this chain that i showed you this one onto the key ring over here like this and secure it really well okay so my chain is now secured it's going to look like this right okay so my chain is secured now now i just have to add my two butterflies to this okay okay so now as you can see this chain is ready and my two butterflies are ready now the task is to connect this butterfly into um, this key ring right so i'm going to just open this and pass the chain through this right and i'm going to secure this very nicely so that the chain doesn't come off so can you see what happened now it's connected now it's chance for my second butterfly which i will add over here adding my second butterfly i will repeat the process and i will pass this through wherever i want to position my second butterfly and again as i said hold it and close it so this is how the final outcome is i'll show you, i'll add a clip here um of the final beautiful pictures or the videos that i take in sunlight but it does look good and i think it's a very good product for personalization
so this is how the final outcome looks i hope you like it if you did please like share and subscribe and i will be leaving a link to my supply store in the pinned comment for you to buy supplies for making this keychain and thank you for watching and see you in the next video